Hey everyone, so I just got back from my trip from Maryland seeing family and I have quite a big haul. Um, it's not all from this trip, but it's things that I purchased for the trip as well and things that came in the mail um, as I got home from the trip and things like that. And so I'll just show it to you all together. <sighs> it is so hot in this room. Um, as you see, I'm on the ground because I had nowhere to put all of this stuff, so, yeah. Um, one of the things that I got was for work, and it's from Express, and it came in the mail. Um, my camera is probably going to have to change the battery pack soon. Um, this is what the jacket looks like. Um, the sleeves are four sleeve buttons, size four, um, it was $108, the lining inside looks nice, and it's just an all around really nice, um, jacket, like, for my, uh, uh skirt, like my suit. The skirt that goes, goes along with that. <clears throat> the skirt that goes along with that is this one, and it's just the pencil skirt. Um, it has little pockets. Ew, that plastic got stuck in my mouth. Um, zipper down the back. Just. Um, and oh, and just the slight slit. Um, I need a suit for work, and I have pants suits, but I just feel like they're not as flattering as a skirt suit would be, and so I got that. And then I also, oh, and that skirt was $72. And then, um, Oh, by the way, I, and I, that, oh, I tried it on in store, the suit, and it looked awesome, um, but the lady that was there was a complete B, and so I didn't want to buy from her, so I just came home and ordered it online. Um, and then I got another skirt for $60, and it's just this, like, cute, flowy, skirt um this also came with a suit like a shirt and a jacket as well which i didn't get um because i have many things that could go with this skirt um i guess i could wear it for work if it's just at, like dinner um and you know it has the zipper and this was 60 dollars. i think i already said that but it's just two-tone skirt really flowy cute and girly and i really like it and then I got quite a bit of makeup, so I think that's what I'm going to go to first. And then I'll go to clothing. Um, so to start out, start out with, I went to Ulta with my cousin, um, and also with my mom, but it was two different trips, So, but I'm just smushing it all together. And I picked up the Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Gel with a pump, and it's for combination oily skin. Um, it's just the Clinique Moisturizer. I've been wanting it for a while and just haven't gotten it. And just, oh, yeah. Come here. Okay, my sister walked in, so starting back over. Um, yeah, so really it's just the moisturizer for combination oily skin. Um... Probably should have just poured out that bag. And then I had like a thousand points. So a thousand points gets you five fifty dollars worth of merchandise off. So I got the naked two palette for those fifty dollars. Um I don't know, I couldn't choose. I wanted to get this one or the Oz palette, but I just thought this one would I you know would use more and the Oz palette I could probably find a lot of duplicates for those shades. So I just got the Naked 2 palette um, 
for the, you know, $50 that I got. Um, I also got a soft matte lip cream by NYX in Tokyo, which is a really, really nice color, um, from, you know, Ulta. And then I got this waterproof concealer from NYX, which I got to put on my lower, um, and my waterline. Instead of using white eyeliner, I'll use a skin toned eyeliner. Um, also I got this shocking pink matte lipstick, which I'm wearing right now from NYX as well, which is just a really, it's not pink, it's purple, but still. I then got two Maybelline Color Whispers, one in Pink Possibilities, which is just like a really bright pink. They're like melting in this room, it's so freaking hot. And one in Petal Rebel, which is just another like pink color. Um... I also got the Naked Flushed palette, which just has a, a blush, a bronzer, and a highlight. Um, yeah. All of this stuff was purchased with my own money, and except for the um, moisturizer. My mom bought me the moisturizer because she knew how much I've been needing and wanting this one, but I've been needing a moisturizer. Um, and then my cousin bought me this because she, like, she has it and loves it, and so she got it for me. It's Vegas Strip Shimmer Strips, um, which is a bronzer, blush, or eyeshadow from Physicians Formula. So, but other than that, I've purchased everything. Um, I then got a Stila eyeshadow in Wheat. I'm sorry that I'll be going through this fast, but there's just too much stuff. Um, I wanted the Stila eyeshadow in Kitten, but they were out, so I got the Stila Smudge Pot in Kitten. And then I also got the Stila eyeshadow in Puppy. Oh, with my, you, like... Clinique, so far, I also was having, like, this really big thing that, like, you know, like, pretty much you got, like, a free gift with everything, and so I got the bottom lash mascara, um, from Clinique with my, um, the purchase of my, um, moisturizer. Really, it's just really cute and has the tiniest brush so that you can get right into those bottom lashes. Um, and... Oh, no, there's two more things. Um, I got an Urban Decay eyeshadow in Midnight Cowboy, which is just a really pretty color. And I got the Anastasia, or Anastasia, um, brow duo that I've heard just amazing things about. Um, I got it in Ash Blonde Taupe. just a brow powder then I went with my mom to Saks Fifth Avenue um, like outlet and they had MAC things there from you know the um, cosmetic company and they had all of these uh, amazing cool like the um, makeup products that are discontinued from MAC so like all the over like, you know, overstock that they had, it, it goes there, I guess, and it's all of the, like, things that MAC doesn't carry, it's all of their, you know, limited time things, so from the the Nemesis Villains, um, line, I got an eyeshadow, whoop, I got an eyeshadow in Sweet Joy, which looks like that. Um, I got a mineralized eyeshadow in Frozen Blue 
from the winter collection. It doesn't say what it was, and I can't remember what it was, but it was the like the winter one. And the white packaging, and it's just like beautiful color. Um, ch -ch -ch -ch. then I got an eyeshadow from the Hey Sailor collection in Barefoot, which is like it looks. It looks gold, but I think it's almost like a olive tone. Like, it's gold with an olive undertone. And then from the Gareth Plunge collection. From this collection. I got... A pigment which comes in like this really cute uh, packaging and it's called G U I S E like goose glues. Um then from the Hey Sailor collection I also purchased or the, my mom bought me this. Um a lipstick and it's in Salute, which is just a nice nude. My, by the way, my mom got me like two of those eyeshadows as well. Um, and then from like the permanent, you know, just regular. These are discontinued, but they're still, they were a part of the permanent line. Um, I don't know why I keep touching my hair. It's just not, it's so hot in here. Um, I got Dalliance, which is like an awesome, an awesome, um, like, olive tone color, but it turns into something else. Like, it's awesome. And then I also got a pressed pigment in warming heart and by like all of the things here like they are cheap like for th this press pigment uh, usually is 28 and I got it for 1475 um and I think that's all the makeup and my camera's about to die so I'll be back in a second okay so I had to charge my battery for a little while but um we're good now next I picked up four pairs of shoes um these are just like some red booties they're lace up they're like really like true two color true red like and they're just little booties um they were originally 55 and then they went on clearance from jc pennies and then went on clearance for like 40 then 30 and then I and then I had them for 14 they had a little spot though that was bothering me and so I got 10% off of that so I got them for eight eight dollars and they are worth they're so worth eight dollars are they worth 55 no 40 no 30 no 14 yes eight definitely had to get those was no stopping me with that one and then um, from Nordstrom or Dillard's. Nordstrom. Macy's? Nordstrom. I picked up these Alfani, um, red shoes, which are definitely really true to, like, color as well. Very, very red. Um, just healed. Uh, I really wanted some red shoes, and I found these before I found the wedges. These were 60. Are they worth 60? Yes. I feel they're so pretty. They're really comfortable. And for work, I wear a lot of Dell colors. And I wanted a red heel so that would spice up, like, color. And also when I go out, I like to wear, like, I usually wear black and, like, nude. And so, like, wearing a red shoe with it would make it look really, really good, I think. Um, then also from... Um, JCPenney, I picked up these heels. They're just like a small, not really kitten heel, but I'm calling them a kitten heel. Um, 
I wanted them for work as well. These are this would be really good with my skirt suit. Um, <clears throat> also with jeans or dress pants or a skirt or just things for work. Um, also when I go like when I have to go on trips. Um, typically I don't want to wear heels on the airplane, but these are comfortable, so they'll be nice to wear. Um, they are made in Italy, and they're long tent, and they were made and designed in Italy, and, uh, they were on sale as well for 30 Um, so I got these. I really, really like them, and I like, you know, they're cute, but they're still classy. I think I can wear them with... Skinny jeans, I can wear them, you know, with my skirts, like I said, again. So, I got those. And then my last pair of shoes are these. They're Tommy Hilfiger. I know I have a small foot, size 6. Um, I like these because I feel like I can also wear these to work. Um, my work isn't, like, sitting at an office, so you're con I'm constantly out. Like, my mom and I, we're always out. We're never, like, home... We do meetings from 7 o'clock in the morning to 10 o'clock at night. Like, we're always out. And that's why I do online high school because I obviously would miss too much school. Um, so I'm allowed to some meetings. Like, you can wear jeans. and so, But it's like business casual. So sometimes you can wear jeans and sometimes you shouldn't but I feel like this can dress up or down an outfit I can wear these with jeans but then I can also wear these with um, some of my dress pants and with just the pop of color and you know the it says Tommy Hilfiger in there with the little um, detailing and these were 33 from Marshalls so those are my shoes and then a bag that I got is this Michael Kors leather bag. Um, it has all my stuff in it, and I picked this up from um, uh, Neiman Marcus Last Call. It has this strap, and then it has this one. It was originally um, $448, and then it went on sale to $3. 34 and then it went on sale again to or uh, and then it went on sale like to 320 and then I got like 20% off so I ended up paying $290 but it was worth it um I really love this bag it's leather and it's like has this detailing I love the detailing on here um I needed a square bag because I carry a lot of documents and I carried them in a thick folder and I wanted a square bag like my mom has her Louis Vuitton and like things like that and I wanted a square bag that I'd be able to fit my documents in so I like the folder and so I don't need to carry it and it's just really nice and I really love it and um hopefully for my birthday I'll be getting the yellow one with the studs but this one I picked up myself and then to clothing I am a bargainista when it comes to clothing. Um, at from um, most of this stuff is all from J.C. Penney. Um, so I got this skirt, which is just like you know, ombres kind of, and it has a lot of bling to it. I feel like this would be like a really like statement skirt with a. With nice, I could wear them with a nude top and then with like bright red shoes and stuff like that. Um, and this was on sale for a five dollars, but then, um, and then it went on sale again. So I got it for two dollars, but originally it's twenty five. And so it's really cute, and I love it. And then from, um, I think this like from Marshalls, I got this like sweater thing just like I think it'd be nice for summer I could wear a bandeau under it and then bandeau bandeau I think it's bandeau right and it like shows a little skin but it still like keeps you warm and then from forever 21 I got this like neon yellow um long sleeve lace shirt that would be cute for summer as well 
Um, and then from an American Eagle, my cousin bought this, but then decided she didn't want it. So she gave it to me. It's like, once again, a holy sweater at ombres from white to red. And um, it's really cute. And it, it's thick, but it's still holy. And so you could wear it. I think it's really versatile. And then I think the rest of this is from TJ Maxx. So I picked up this, like, army green um, jacket which everyone's wearing um, lately it has you know um, stud detailing and it cinches down around here your waist has pockets um, in the back you can see that it cinches more everyone's been wearing them um, originally 35 and I got it on sale for 15 um, and I don't know, it just like has, you know, the buttons and everyone's been wearing these lately, I feel like, and I love them personally. My mom thinks it makes me look like a granny, but I love it. Um, I think this is like, it's not thick, but it's warm enough that I could wear it if it was warm, but it's also thin enough just to throw on. I then got like the same color, like an army green, um, collared top which wasn't on sale, so $17. It says that it's just like an olive color, and I got it in a medium. Um, because people with bigger chest, it kind of sucks that you can't get smalls, because I feel like then this part would fit better, but whatever. And the studying goes all the way around. I just really like this shirt, and I thought it'd be really cute. I'm really into pastels for spring. But I really just think that, like, this army, like, kind of green olive color could look really good and transition really well into the spring as well. Um, I then picked up this shirt, which my mom also thinks is ugly, but it was on sale for $2. So I don't think you can really go wrong with $2. I like this shirt personally with, like, a tank top under. It shows your tummy a little. It's quarter length sleeves. And I don't know, I just really like it. And... It was on sale for $2, like I said. You can't go wrong for with $2. And, yeah, it's really cute. I really like it. I got this peplum top as well. Um, and this was $25. Once again, this wasn't on sale. But I like this. I feel like I can wear this to work um, as well for just a pop of color. Um... There are some flower, you know, the lace is flower, and then the detailing has many different colors on it, and it's cut out on the back. Um, this will be perfect for home, not home, but, like, going out with friends and, like, just going out. And then also I could really wear this under a blazer or, like, something like that, and it would still look really good. Um, oh, I forgot. There are some more things for Marshalls. And then for Marshalls, I also got this shirt for $16, and it's um, just a work shirt, a collared shirt um, with lace on the sleeves, full-length sleeves with gold detailing, and then the buttons are all, like, tan, they're nude, except for the top one, and... Um, yeah, and it just has like some ruching that goes down the middle. It's a really cute top, and I like the lace detailing. And um, with like gray suits or black suits, tan like gives it a pop of color, even though it's not really colorful. So I definitely love that. Most of the clothes I get are for work, but this is sheer, and it's um, I really like wearing it. I'd wear it at home, out with friends as well. So, and then what else? I also got this shirt, which is for work under a blazer, but I would wear this once again out with friends. Um, it ha it's like a Peter Pan collar um, with flowers on it, and it's really like dainty and girly. Uh, as it goes down, there's like the little dainty detailing on like through the bodice and on the bottom. It's sheer and black, and this was $12.99, and I really like it. I really, really like it. I would wear this out with friends and, like, things like that. Um, oh, I forgot one thing.
I also got this shirt from Nordstrom um, from Topshop. It once again has this collar and then has like little details on it and it's really cute and I don't know, dainty as well I guess. Also for Marshalls, I got one of these skeleton shirts which are really in right now. Um, but I feel like I found like the perfect one for me because it has a roses and skulls down the middle. And it also, then it goes into like the skeleton like T and it's like kind of looks like a heart. But it's really cute and I feel like I could wear this with a bandeau and um, it was on sale for $10. But it's really cute. I felt like I found the perfect one for me. And then... Once again from JCPenney, I got this sweater, which looks like it's like, you know, cut out in the back, but it's like a color block sweater, green, gray, and blue, and um, since it cuts out in the back, you get like a feel like a little bit of breeze, but it's still like a sweater, and no, oh no, it's really comfy, and then... You're going to think I'm nuts, but this is a skirt, I, I dress, it's a color block dress, so it has a black collar. Oh, well it's unbuttoned, so maybe if I button it, it will look, you'll get the feel for it better. I will button the first button only though. So the, it, the collar is black and then it goes into blue and then it goes into black for the skirt parts black. And then the very bottom has some, like, orange, some coral colors. And then the top, the sleeves are mint green with coral sleeves and buttons. So it's, like, really awesome, I feel like. And if I wear it with a bow, I just think it will be even cooler. And I really like the color block thing, so looks feels great for me. And then I got two pair of high-waisted shorts which from JCPenney, which I was, like, shocked about. I've been looking for high-waisted shorts everywhere, and I am just not willing to pay $60 for high-waisted shorts from Urban Outfitters. So I got two pairs of them for only $17. Each pair was $17 from JCPenney. These are just regular, um, some regular ones. Um... You know, just a regular denim, high-waisted shorts. The back, you know, they're just kind of, like, discolored. And then these ones are, like, distressed and discolored, like, ombre tie-dye looking, looking high-waisted shorts. They go pretty high, actually, and, um, yeah, just, you know, the high-waist and I don't know, they're really cute. Here, maybe if I button it, you'll see it better once again. But maybe not. But yeah, this is just what it looks like. And they're really, really cute. And I think that is it. That is it. Um, I really hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Um... I know I don't do, like, many of them anymore, but I think this one was pretty big and, you know, not rolling in dough, so you got to have the money to do the hauls. But this one was collective, and I feel like I really love it, and things, I will get really good use of all of these things. So, um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, and remember the whole sharing the love thing that I'm doing. Um, you could check out my... Uh, purple liner tutorial for the share of the love um, uh, information and I'll also link it below so once again don't forget rate comment and subscribe follow me on Twitter Instagram and like my Facebook page and I will talk to you guys soon